The protest on Orwell Road, which is the inspiration for this anthology, began on the 24th of February 2022. People said silence is not enough. And there were lots of things happening both obviously in Dublin and London and places around the world. And ultimately, South Africa wanted to be part of the family of nations again. And they decided they had to do something. Special thanks to everybody who wrote their pieces in this book, but also to the wider protesters group. I, I believe everybody from the Ukrainian community knows about you. Uh, many of us met you in person and uh, we have massive gratitude and respect for you. You give voice uh, to us, you give voice to other Irish people uh, who would like to express themselves but possibly don't have uh, an opportunity how. Uh, Ukraine will never forget uh, the Irish Open and their homes and hearts to the Ukrainians fleeing the war and uh, saving our children from uh, the barbaric actions of the Russian army in Ukraine. People have different views on economic, social and political issues. People follow different teams and sports and people have different tastes in food and music. However, on one issue, we all stand united and that is our complete opposition to the criminal and illegal invasion of, of, of Ukraine by Putin and his murderous regime. I stand with the simple blue and yellow flag. I stand in witness for the atrocities committed by the Russians against the women and children, the old, the disabled and sick people and also animals. Your faith was strong, but you need a proof. I saw the bathing on a roof, her beauty and the moonlight overthrew you. She tied you to a kitchen chair. She broke your throne and she cut your hair. And from your lips, she drew. I am overcome by a feeling of despair and helplessness. My thoughts then turn to the proud and patriotic Ukrainian people whose courage and indomitable spirit of endurance will not be broken. We must believe that their determination to achieve independence, freedom and justice will not wane and that those who have paid the ultimate price by giving their lives for their country will not have died in vain, that they will be free. On and on it goes. Indiscriminate bombing, the levelling of beautiful historical cities, rape, murder, the forced migration of millions of Ukrainian women and children, maybe never to see their husbands and fathers alive again. The cold, unemotional and insane planning to exterminate a free, democratic, peaceful country. Bucha, Chernihiv, Irpin, Izium, Kharkiv, Kherson, Kramatorsk, Mariupol, Serbodonesk, Zobyansk is barbaric. The anguish of Ukraine and the world cries out for justice. It affects me. Even though it all went wrong, I stand before the Lord of Song, but nothing on my tongue but Hallelujah, Hallelujah, oh Hallelujah, Hallelujah, Hallelujah. Sadolia, we do not see.
Boroženki, jak rosa na solci, zapanuje mi, mi bratia, u svojich storonci. Show me, bro.